Marchino cherries growing right here on the trees. You know, we've been growing them for 50, 60 years here. They go right from here to the processing plant and then into the jars and then, and then into the grocery stores. And the family relationship is definitely a big part of what goes on here and on many family farms. The only job I've ever had is working on this farm. I've never had another job in my life. You know, I went away to college and got a degree somewhere else and decided oh, I'm never going to do this farming thing. And it turned out after a couple years working in the corporate world that farming was for me and I'm back here and couldn't be happier to. Uh, great place to live. The city wasn't the life that I really wanted and I'm happy to be back here. I'm thrilled he's here but I thought he'd be back someday. He's gonna be the third generation on this farm so you know that's a plus and he's got to get busy and have some children so there's a fourth generation pretty soon. <laughs> Mother Nature doesn't always cooperate. Sometimes it rains. We need to be out here and sometimes it's too cold. There's no stops when it comes to raising cherries. If the consumer wants the best product in the end, that means the farmers here have got to make sure we see that through as efficiently as possible. That means when it's two o'clock in the morning and the wind isn't blowing and the trees need attention, that's the time that we're going to be out here. Technology has started to come into the farming world a little bit more. All of the blocks on our farm are, are numbered and coded. They are specific to variety and, and many other things that are associated with a cherry itself. Uh, so the tree behind me has its, a unique code compared to a tree that's maybe a quarter mile down the road. Being able to track the fruit from it being on the tree into the, the consumer's jar. That's really, really important that we're able to do that. People want to know where their, their food's coming from, and we want to be able to show them what we did to get it to them. I think that's a really important thing. It's a good feeling when you go through the whole process and you're able to produce something viable.